Hello participants I welcome you in this MOOC course on learning and teaching In this video I am going to tell you that how you can navigate on Swayam where you can find your units where you can find your quiz how you can participate in discussion forum and how you can submit your assignment When you go on Swam website that is swam.gov.in and you have already enrolled in our course first you need to log in when you will log in you may log in from your microsoft account you may log in from your gmail account let me log in from my gmail account this account should be the same which you have registered at the time of registering yourself in our course once you will log in you can see your email is there so just click here and go on the my course page so when you will go on the my course it will show you the courses or course in which you have enrolled so you need to click on go to the course it will redirect you on the course page the same page with you may have seen when you have enrolled in the course at that time here it was coming enroll in the course and now it is coming go to the course so you click on go to the course when you will click on go to the course it will show you the course interface now i am going to tell you how you can go ahead in your course here you can see it is the brief introduction this is the course intro video about your course instructor and all other details course layout and everything is here and here you can see the list of the books or references given to you for your reading on this side under the head course outline you will see the contents of each and every week will come here so for example when you will click on week 1 you can see here is the week 1 and the number of lessons included in week 1 and the quiz of week 1 So from here you can explore what is the content of week one. For example, if you want to click on lesson one, you just click on lesson one. So here is the content of your week one lesson one, starting with the week introduction. That is the what is this unit in this week? What are the objectives? Then you can see the content. Content is having an embedded video which you need to watch before moving to the next section. So in this way you can come back and you can click on next lesson so you can see the content of the next lesson then you can click on next lesson you can see the content on next lesson so in this way every week content will be uploaded and will be visible to you in first week the first week content will be visible to you in second week the content of week 1 and week 2 will be visible similarly in week 3 the content of all three weeks will be visible as you know that every week you have to go for a quiz also so in each weekly module there will be a quiz link when this quiz link will be active you can see here quiz you just click on it when you will click on it your quiz will appear here it is written assignment not submitted so you can see the questions the options and after that submit answer when you will submit your answer your quiz will be submitted if unit is ending the unit may have unit summary if unit is not ending unit may not have the unit summary so this is how you can explore the content and the quiz the third thing is the discussion forum to explore the discussion forum you need to click on ask a question button when you will click on ask a question button you will see that your discussion forum will appear here here you can see that this is the first discussion forum of this course dear participants in this section we will discuss any one concept issue theme related to each unit and when you will click on introduce yourself option here you can see this is the first forum which the course administrator has created welcome to the course and he or she is requesting you to click on the reply button 
and to introduce yourself in brief like your name your place your present qualification or profession and also one reason due to which you have joined the course so for reply you just click on post reply when you will click on post reply a box will appear and on the top of the post you can write your reply and then you can click on post if you have any other query which you want to raise and your query is not listed in the discussion you can click on new topic when you will click on new topic you just give the title of your discussion and you write your question or your query here whenever you will submit it it will be appeared on the discussion page so in this way you can interact with your course instructors as well as your peer group when you will click on the announcement section this is very important section whenever a new announcement will be there it will appear here like this is the first announcement you can see how you have proceed what is your progress for this you need to click on the progress section when you will click on progress section here you can see what is your progress because it is a new course so no progress is there so in this way you can navigate through your course and you can access different options like content quiz discussion forum and announcements i hope that this small video will help you in navigating smoothly through the course on swayam platform